Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you how to make this beach bag. It's a beach bag, or you can use it also as a market bag. Um, it's very nice, um, you can use it with two colors, one color you can do it. It's not um, difficult to make, as you will see. Hope that you try it. So, we start with the chains. I started, I made 73 chains. Now, um, you can make more chains if you want. If you want a bigger bag, you make more chains. It doesn't matter how many chains you make. There's not a multiple. I made 73. But as I told you, if you want a bigger bag, you can make more chains. Now, we go in the third chain. One, two, three. We go in the third one here. And we make a treble. And we're going to make a treble. Treble or double crochet, depends how you call it. In every chain that you have. So you make a treble or double crochet. In every chain that you have, you continue all the row like this until you arrive in the last one. Then I show you what you have to do. So as you can see, the chains are ready all and we have the last one here. And in the last one, we're going to make three trebles or double crochet, as I told you. That is one. Two. And three. So in the last one, we made three. So we can turn. Now we're going to continue making a treble. I think it's better that you make four. You make four trebles here. In, this, in the last one you make four trebles. And then we're going to go in every treble, in every chain here we have here. And we're going to do a treble in each one of them. Here you find here, and you make a treble in each one of them. Another one here. As you can see, over here, I'm making it over here, as you can see. And we make a treble in each treble that we made before. You continue all the row like that until you arrive here on the first one that we made and then you'll show where we here the chains that we skipped until you arrive here and then I tell you how to continue as you can see the row is ready too we made a treble on the trebles here and we arrived here here where we have this chain here the three the first three the three chains that we used the first one here that we skipped when we started the first one here and we make three trebles there one two and three then you have that was the first one you have the last one here chain you skipped three you go to the last one and you finish with a slip stitch and that is another round as you can see this will turn like this and we're going to continue like that so now we're going to start the next row we start with three chains we go to the first chain and we're going to make a treble on every one treble or double crochet how you call it in every chain that we have you continue making a treble in every chain that you have. Like that. Continue making a treble in every one that you have. Now we have arrived here in the corner as you can see and you have to do the same 
you have to make one treble in each one of them. You're going to, not going to make four like we did before. You have to make one treble or double crochet in each chain. Here we made one. We make another one here. You continue the same. You make in every chain another one here. Another one here. And you continue with a treble in every chain that you have. As you can see here it started to turn. That is how because the bag is going this is the um here um the edge of the bag, the bottom of the bag, that's why it has to turn. So as I told you, you make a treble in each chain you have. Always a treble, and then you continue with a treble all along here. As you can see, we arrived here at the edge at, at the, where we started here. We made the last one here. We're going to go in the chain here in the first one. We finish with a slip stitch. And that is the other side. We finish this row. Now we're going to start again with three chains. We're going to do the same. Three chains. And the treble in every chain that you have all around. So you continue like we did with a treble in every chain all around. And you continue the rows after. Then I show you how many rows I have made. So I continue this row, then I, I make other rows until I see that I have enough rows um, for the bottom of the back and then I start the, the other um, pattern. So you continue like the row we did before, a treble in each one of them and continue making rows. I will tell you how many rows I made. So as you can see, I made six rows in all. One, two, three, four, five, six, no, seven rows. I made seven rows. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven rows. I made seven rows. And this is the bottom of the back, as you can see. Now I'm going to start with another color from where I finished. I'm going to start with another color. And I'm going to start. with five chains one two three four and five now I'm going to skip two chains one two go to the third one and make a treble so these five chains serve as a treble and two chains I make two chains I skip another two one two and I go in the third one and I make a treble another two chains I skip one two I go in the third one and I make a treble another two chains I skip another two one two I go in the third one and I make another treble another two chains skip one two in the third one and i make a treble treble or double crochet how you call it and you continue all the round like that you skip two chains and you make two chains you skip two chains and you make a treble in the next one another two chains you skip two and the treble in the, in the next one and you continue all the row like that this row is ready as you can see and i finished with a slip stitch in the third chain here from where we started now we start with seven chains one two three four five six and seven we skip the first space here and we go here and we do four trebles we make four treble or double crochet one two three and four. This um, treble is the English version and double treble is the American version. 
Now, five chains. One, two, three, four, and five. We skip the space here. We go to the next one. And we make another four trebles. One, two, three, and four. Another five chains. One, two, three, four, and five. We skip this one and we go here. And we make another four trebles. One, two, three, and four. Another five. One, two, three, four, and five. We skip this one. We go here and we make another four. And you continue all the row like that. You make four trebles. You continue like that. You make five chains. You skip one and then the next one you make um, four trebles. And there are five chains and you continue all the row like that. I arrived at the, at the last here. But as you can see here I have three remaining. Three. I don't have four. If I had four remaining, I would finish. I would have finished. Okay, good. But I have three finished because here I have to. This I have to skip it here. Four. Then I have to skip one and then make another four. But since I have three, I cannot do that. If I if you finish with four, it's okay. You will finish it okay. But I finished it with three. So what I'm going to do? I'm going to skip this one. The same. I'm going to make two trebles here, one and two. I'm going to go here and I'm going to make one treble so that I have four like this. I go in the third chain here and there I have four. Since I, I finished with three here, I made four and still it will be okay. But if you have four here, you will be okay. You will finish exactly how you have to finish. This row is ready, as you can see, we finished here. Now we're going to start from here. So we go in the first chain with a slip stitch from here. And we make three chains, one, two, and three. And a treble. In the space here, we make three chains and a treble. Two chains. And another two trebles in the same place. One and two. Two chains. We go here in the middle of these four here. And we make a single crochet or double crochet, how you call it. Two chains. Another two trebles here in the space. One and two. Two chains. And another two trebles. One and two. Another two chains. We go here in the middle, here, and we make single crochet, double crochet. Another two chains. We go here now in the space. Two trebles. One and two. Two chains. And another two trebles or double crochet, how you call it. One and two. Another two chains in the middle of these four here. We make a single crochet or double crochet. Another two chains and we continue like that. Two trebles. One and two. Two chains and another two trebles in the same place. One and two. And you continue like that, two chains, then in the middle here, another two chains, two, two chains and two. You continue all the row like that. This row is ready, I finished with a slip stitch here on the chains. Now we're going to start from here. So we go there with a slip stitch like this until we arrive here. We do three chains. We're going to do this row again. We did here. So. We make three trebles, one, two, and three. Three because we have the chains and with the chains they are four. Five chains, one, two, three, four, and five. 
we skip here and we go here in the middle of these four and we make four trebles one two three and four five chains one two three four and five we skip here we go here in the middle of these two and we make four trebles one We make four trebles here. One, two, three, treble or double crochet, and four. One, two, three, four, five. I'm used to say treble. I always say treble, but in a treble is in English version, and uh, double crochet is. Um, USA version and we make four and you continue all the row like that you make four here trebles five chains four treble five chains you continue all the row like that this row is ready as you can see we finished with five chains and a single crochet here now we're going to start from the middle here we're going to do again this row so these two rows this row and the row i'm going to show you you have to repeat them always this row and the row i'm going to show you so you go here in the middle and you make a single crochet single crochet there two chains you go here two trebles or double crochet two chains one and two and another two trebles here one and two two chains one and two you go in the middle of these four and you make a single crochet or double crochet how you call it another two chains and another two trebles Two chains and another two trebles in the same place one and two two chains you go in the middle here and you make a single crochet or double crochet two chains and again two trebles one and two like the row we did before two chains and another two trebles in the same place one and two and you continue all the row like that like I like I showed you you continue all the row like that so now we finished with a slip stitch here in the chains and we're going to start from here now we're going to start from here so we go with a slip stitch until we arrive here you always start from here you make three chains and three trebles one two and three now we're repeating this row you make five chains one two three four and five we go in the next space and we make four trebles and you have to repeat like this five chains one two three four and five you go here and you make four trebles so we are repeating this row here we are repeating this row here you make four trebles and five chains always and then after this row you repeat this row you always repeat these two rows this row and this row and you continue repeating those two rows until you, you have the length that you want now you can continue with the same color you can make two colors you make, can make more colors I'm not sure how I'm going to make it I'm not sure if I'm going to continue with white or violet and white I'll see um, you continue the length you want then we'll, we'll, go, we'll show you how to finish with these rows and how to make the handles
So now, as you can see, I made it this long. Now you will make it how long you want. I made it this long. I used some this color. I, I made white and violet and white. But you can use even one color if you want. And the length, you, you do as much as you, you prefer the length. Now we're going to do to continue with the pattern. Now, what we're going to do, so we start with three chains, one, two, and three. Then we skip two, two chains. We skip two chains, one, two, we go in the third one. Sorry, we start with five because we have to make two chains, five, three for the tables and two chains. We skip two chains, one, two, we go in the third one and we make a treble or double crochet. Two chains, we skip another two chains, one, two, we go in the third one and we make another treble. Another two chains, we skip another two, one, two, we go in the third one, we make a treble. Another two chains, we skip one, two, we go in the third one and we make a treble or double crochet. Another two chains, we skip one, two, we go in the third one and we make a treble. And you continue all the row like that. You make two chains, you skip two chains, one, two, you go in the third one and you make a treble or double crochet. You continue all around like that. So this row is ready too, as you can see. Now I'm going to start with this color now, this row. As for the colors, you can choose any colors you, you, you prefer. I'm going to start from here and I'm going to make three, three, three chains. I'm going here in the space and I'm going to do two trebles, one and two. A treble on the next treble and the tre two trebles in the next space, one and two. And a treble on the other treble. Another two trebles in the next space, one and two and the treble on this treble and you continue all the row like that two trebles here in the space and the treble on the treble all around you continue like that so this row is ready too as you can see i turned all around with the, with the treble now we're going to start the next row we make three chains and we're going to do a treble on each treble that we have all around a treble on each treble you continue all the round making a treble on each treble so now I made those two rows I made two rows now we're going to make the handles so to make the handles To make the handles, I made the bag like this. I folded it like this in two. Then I marked it from here to here. There are 15 centimeters, 15 centimeters from here to here. From here to here, there are another 15 centimeters and I marked on the other side too. 15 centimeters on the other side too. Now, we are going to start from here. So we start from there. Pull up a stitch and make three chains. One, two and three. 
and we start making treble in every treble that we have we start making the treble a treble on every treble that we have until you arrive to the first marker here you continue making a treble on each one of them until you arrive at this marker the first marker here as you can see we arrived near the first marker here so now here we start making chains to make the handles it's a chains you make depending on how large you want to make the handles you continue making the, the chains and see how many chains you want to make for the handles and the handle has to go you have to put the handle it has to go around to this to this the other marker that you made so you continue making the chains then i will tell you how many chains i made in mine and um, for the handles so the chains are ready i made 60 chains if you want to make more if you want it longer you can make more i made 60 chains now we go to the other marker that we have here the second one we, we skip all these trebles here we skip them all these we skip all these these trebles here and we go to the second marker here and we do a treble and we continue making a treble this is the handle as you can see this will be the handle you continue making a treble until you arrive to the third marker so continue making the treble until you arrive at the third marker continue like this until you arrive at the third marker so now we arrived at the third mark here so we're going to make another 60 chains because before I made 60 chains now depends how many chains you made on the other side here you have to make the same I made 60 so I'm going to make another 60 chains so the 60 chains are ready we go to the fourth mark we skip these all these we go to the fourth mark and we continue making a treble on each treble that we have you continue making a treble until you arrive at the last one as you can see we finished here with a slip stitch now we start again we make three chains and we're going to make a treble on every treble that we have you make a treble on each treble that you have until you arrive here where you have the chains then i tell you what you have to do so now we arrived here at the chains and we're going to do a treble in every chain that we have here you make a treble or double crochet depends how you call it in every chain that you have you continue making a treble all around all around these chains you continue making a treble so as you can see this is ready i made it all the handle and you continue with a treble or double crochet all around and on this this one too you continue all around with a treble this round is ready as you can see we made the handles here we have to make another row so we make another row the, the way we made it treble on each treble that we have we make another row so now the two rows are ready as you can see now i'm going to turn with white i'm going to start with a single crochet with white so you start like this and I'm going to make a single crochet or double crochet how you call it all around 
with white so you make a single crochet or double crochet all around all the way around with white like this so this is ready to around now I'm going to make around here with single crochet or double crochet depends how you call it we we'll start from here and we go all around here making a single crochet or double crochet all around here inside of the handle this is the final result how the back came as you can see this is very nice inside I lined it I lined it so it doesn't you can leave it without lining if you want but I prefer to line it you can use it as a as a beach bag or you can use it to go to the market with it it's very nice as you can see hope that I you understood what I was doing and that you try it bye for now